There we go. Hello, guys. Well, that's not right. It says I've been streaming for 24 hours. Definitely not correct. But that's okay. I'm not worried about something like that. Honestly, it's good for me if it says I've been streaming for 24 hours. Although, if it says that I've been streaming for 24 hours without any viewers, that, that actually is a little... A little bit of a pain. That, that's not right. And I am today, so, you know, that, that's always a good sign. I do love this song a lot. I don't know, there's something about it that just sings to me a little bit. You know, it's like, I don't know, it's, it's got this uh, tune to it that, that just makes me happy. I don't know what it is. It's good, though. Don't get me wrong, it's very, very good. I'm gonna be starting a little late tonight, sorry guys. I just, like, I biked home and then I made a cup of tea and it took me a second to get all that ready. So, like, you know, it's, you know, it's all happening. It's all coming together right now. Hey, I'm Melodic. How are you doing tonight? Sorry, just a little tired. <laughs> Eat a fruit. Okay, good. I'm actually kind of looking forward to that, like, a lot. I love this song so much. It just like, I don't know, it fuels me. There's a part of it that just makes me so happy. Man. There's like a set, like, there's, there's a set that I want to transmog here, but I'm not sure what exactly it is I want to, like, use for it, if that makes sense. Like, I'm, like, looking over through armor pieces, like, every day, kind of, like, being like, oh, is this what I want to be using? Is this what I want to be using? Is this, like, kind of, like, the look I'm going for? And I, I never can put it together. I don't know if you guys share that feeling sometimes. Well, that's actually a really good look. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and just craft one of those so that way I have it. All right, uh, let's go ahead and open up the hub. That is searching for a hub. I'm, I'm looking to make a hub. Create a hub. Let's make all the things that are supposed to be made. How are you doing tonight, Melodic? Though I've been, uh, I went biking today, and I'm very tired. But you know that's okay, cause I, I'm trying to make it a regular thing again. I really, really miss biking to and from everywhere like I used to, and so we're just we're getting back into it. 
It's gonna be it's gonna be a good time. A good, very exhausting, miserable, fun time. You hit HR one hundred. Oh, congrats! That that's kind of a that's kind of huge, honestly. That that's a huge achievement. Oh, I don't have my lighting on correctly. And the speaker is going through the round thing. Give me a second. And you got an air cut. Oh, that's exciting. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and create the hub here. Feel free to join us. Three, two, one, go. I was drilling and saw PVC pipes, two drill bits, and five screws snapped. Oh my god, that sucks. I'm sorry to hear that. I don't know, that should be visible. And let me go ahead and get the Discord link up. And by Discord link, I mean the hub ID, which... Got I unplugged my keyboard just like at the exact wrong moment. 19-1599-4800. There we go, look at that. Now we can go ahead. Do one of those. All right, now we have it open. If anybody wants to join us, now is the uh, the time. Can you put the hub in chat? Because I <laughs> 160p ain't great for reading. You know, I, uh, yes, I, I might be able to manage that. Give me a second. make me plug in and unplug my keyboard. Are we friends on this game? Can't you just find me in your friend list? 19-1599-4859-1049. There we go. It better copy and paste that. Just in case uh just in, uh, just in case you plan on um just in case somebody else pops in here. Now, now it's your job. It's your turn to, to make people do the thing. All right, this looks right. Item set. We're going to bring the sword and shield meta here. However, I don't need these three items. And what I could do is take items. No, we aren't friends. Oh, I see. We should fix that. Shoot me a friend request. I'll go ahead and accept it. That's right. I only take my friends through requests. Hermes, there you are. All right, this is the, this is a little bit worse. So my, my switch is doing that one thing where my controller just doesn't always do the thing I want it to. Um, should be in there. And internet's good today, so I'm, I need to take advantage. Go for it. I hope today I hope today is a nice, good, fun day for hunting for all of us. And then, what is the... I think it's Scatterfish, I want to say, that combined into Mega Barrel Bombs. Because this set is, like, meant to, like, knock monsters to sleep at least twice. Yeah, Scatterfish. So take item. We can at least, like, throw away some Scatterfish as we... The chances of actually making large Barrel Bombs on a hunt are pretty low. But that's okay. I'm not just... Oh, there they are. Do I add you as a friend? So what you what you do is you can just send me a friend request. Here, I can actually show you. I could actually show. I could actually just send you a friend request, I guess. Also, you can go ahead and start us off tonight. If you want to post something, go for it. Um, but yeah, I could go to like here. Go to uh, that one thing that's like add people or. Uh, uh, Give me a second. Letting people know that this is what's happening. And then going to like uh, that one thing. Is it wireless settings? No. Is it friends? 
Friend registration? Oh, there we go. Send a one. And then I can just select you and go ahead and send it. There we go. Now you can add me as a friend after the stream. Don't do it right now. Ooh, this will be fun. Chaos Gore, I'm a fan. Let's see. What do I not think I'm going to be fighting? Water, perhaps? Just eat Defender. And I guess I still owe you a fruit, so let me get started on that real quick. Hopefully that these fruits are much better than yesterday's. Yesterday's fruit was actually disgusting. That was a shame. But these are looking... These these have potential for all kinds of things. Oh, and there's Z, our final member for the night. Go ahead and uh, shoot them a nice little quickie. Welcome. Here's the chat if you're interested. I need a ton of wings. Okay. Well, we can try our best here. If you want me to, we could always sleep bomb the wings. That'll do plenty of damage to them. It's not dripping with juice, this peach isn't, but... Oh, wait. Wait. Oh, never mind. It might be. It, it had a, a drop. Oh, no. You know what? This might work. It's a, it's a little a little soft on the inside, but... Nope, that's terrible. We're going to hope that the next one is better. And three more for the six hatch. Okay. So you need a total of 11. That's a lot of wings. I will say. Give me a second. I'm just going to test this one. Oh, this one looks really good. Acceptable. Oh, man. Come on, controller. I want you to actually work today. If you stop working, I'm going to be very upset. There we go. Hmm, I see the issue. I might have to go and adjust that in the settings after this hunt. For whatever reason, my camera isn't working as well as it should be, so I'm gonna have to play like I'm like like old school. Before I had a pro controller and a left joystick. Or right joystick. Back in the day, I like when I played on my 3DS only. There was a period of time where if I wanted to like target the monster, I just had to tap the L button like once every single time. That was my only option. And I've gotten spoiled by the idea of having a, uh, a joystick, I guess you could say. Oh my god, I thought I I thought I jumped on that wall. Can you not do that? Am I crazy? Oh my god, come on. Okay, this is so bad. I, I, I yeah, I definitely need to reset this controller. That's uh, that's probably what the issue is. Sometimes it just like if it, if it, like that. You see that? That that's not okay. I'm not even hitting a button right now. There we go. All right, and now it stopped working entirely. Amazing. If I die, I'm blaming my controller 100%. Come on, man. Wish me luck on this fight. This might go very, very, very poorly, given given uh, given the current circumstances of my controller. Oh, never mind, Terra. Oh my God! Come on. 
Oh, this is a good time to do some alchemy stuff. There we go. <laughs> DPS go bird. Indeed. Oh, there goes the tail. I really didn't think it was going to cut that easily. Oh my god. Stop. God, this controller's playing so bad. Amazing. Caught between a heavy bow gunner and a, and a hard place. Exactly where I was. Oh, man. You gotta take the shiny. Ooh, a mantle. A whole mantle from a shiny? That's not bad. Come on, controller. Play with me. Play the game with me. There we go. Yeah, this is going to require a reset from my uh, controller if the camera is going to keep doing that. There's a way to do it. It just takes a minute. There we go. That wasn't bad. Was this G rank or was this a different level of monster? Come on. All right, we're gonna see if that helped it. I just unplugged it and plugged it back in. What the with the sticks being neutral? Sometimes that just does the trick. Because there used to be this thing back in uh back when I played on the GameCube controllers would have a drift issue but it wasn't like a real drift issue what would happen is so when the controller was like held in a certain direction yeah it's still doing a thing give me one second this should take no time at all uh change grip order and of course the rarest drop again that's not bad Are you serious? Come on, game. I might just have to switch to Joy-Cons. You know, it's been so long since I played with Joy-Cons. But honestly, that's what the game is slowly inching me towards. This is the way it's going to be. Is that crit status plus five? It's kind of cool. Never say that you don't need them. Because should you ever decide to make that set, they're going to be super handy. Like when I get rare drops, it's so nice. Alright, I think it's Monet Man's turn. turn. You're 140 points from HR 101. Man, that's a shame. The only need one for the set, which I'm making. Gotcha. Well, that's okay. You got the one, then. We, 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 we work with those. This is the worst. I hate this controller so much right now. I'm, like, even just tempted to, like, turn off the switch and turn it back on. But that actually doesn't sound like it's going to fix it right now. Oh, 
Let me see if I can... There we go. Alright, we're just gonna hope that that does the trick. Ooh, another Gourmangala. Don't mind if I do. I'm gonna pick up another Infinity Oil. Checking all the boxes real quick. You know, the things that we do. I for fire res this time. And polisher, that's nice. I'm a fan of polisher. Let's see, I want to say this guy spawns over here. Hmm. Man, but today work was a pain. I'm so glad to be home. I'm so sick of work. Thankfully, that was my last day. So. And my last day, I mean, I get tomorrow off and I have to go back in like Tuesday or something. Like that. But, like, you know. Last day I had to, like, show up this week. I have tomorrow. And probably Monday, I think. I, I have to double check that one. Oh, I got tail web. Ooh, he's wrecked. So dangerous. There we go. I'm dying in, in the game. I'm dying in real life due to peaches. Peach fuzz is actually like kind of like one of like it's like one of my least favorite things about fruit. Like why why did why does why why does fruit have hair? You know, it's like eating hair and like I don't know that fuzz. Like I don't know. I mean, is there anybody who actually enjoys peach fuzz? Like I know for a fact there has to be. Because obviously people are enjoying it. Like people have things that they enjoy. However, I cannot stand people. Like I don't know. I, I like I, I still technically prefer nectar than anything else. What? Oh, we must have put it to sleep and parrot it at the same time again. That's so sad. All just stepping over each other. Eat here. back into the red before we go ahead and there we go. Pop me one of these. Be using one of these. And then uh run for one of these. There we go.
There we go. Big boy damage time. At least that's the way it would seem, right? Oh, that was a bad trade. Could have done so much more with that. That is it. Finish him. Get that tail. Ah, no tail. But it, it, it was a nice kill. There we go. Easy. Another, another nice, simple, fun hunt, if you will. I'm gonna go ahead and steal myself this last slice of peach. Get that first fruit counter of the night off. A shredder, not a bad bond. And a vile frenzy crystal, also not a bad bond. I actually needed hyper G rank Megala scales. <coughs> well, somebody had you, I guess. Somebody's got your back out there. And it ain't me. I'm just, you know, doing my job. This is so, this is very much pog. <laughs> I'm glad to hear that for you. God, sorry, I'm just like dying on peach fuzz. I hope you don't mind. I just poured myself a cup of tea so I can help wash some of that down here in a minute. Ugh. Man, I have so many horn coins. I like, I don't even know what to do with them at this point. I just keep collecting them. I'm gonna have infinite horn coins. I'm going to have so much money, I don't know what to do with it. In Monster Hunter. All right, I think it's Z's turn. I got four of them. Nice. It's always a good thing. I don't know. I love it when, like, you just, like, you're like, wow, I need this item. And then, like, you, you complete the quest, and it's like, and you got the item. Wow. Like I, like I, like you know, this is just this is just the way it's supposed to be, all the time. See, we're gonna mess around with this set. I do. I definitely love this particular set these days. It's it's so dumb and easy and fun. It's like everything. Item set. I do like Z's set right here. Oh, they're also running the Black Claw set, but then they have like this really cool looking like armor set that goes with it. I'm a fan, honestly, big fan. I myself have to uh, fix up my armor set and then also get that crit up, a duel. Although for them to have all that, what are they running? Like they, they must have some insane talisman. Quick Sheet and Knockout King. Oh, and they're gone. In that case, I will be posting. Hey, Bobotosh, it's your turn. Yes, thank you, Bobotosh. Um, let's do this one. Oh, wow, he was the next guy. I know, I, I told him that he could post. It's a shame. It's having fun. But, you know, sometimes, like, people just got places to be. They got things to do. It's totally, totally understandable. If anybody's in chat and wants to join us, now is your time. Now is your chance. I will be enjoying this. Oh, no, I won't. That's too hot. 
<laughs> you ever pick up a tea cut and you're just like, you know, I could drink this. And then you pick it up and it hits your hand. And you're like, I can't drink this. This is going to kill me. I want to be able to taste tomorrow. Tomorrow I'm making nachos. So I really, really, really want to be able to taste tomorrow. Going to get a nice big pan of them. Right, like, like put out my blue corn chips all over the place. Smother those things in black beans, bell peppers, cheese. It's going to be great. It's desolate. Indeed. Oh, there's Miku. Miki Zoo. Welcome. Here you Twitch chat if you're interested. There we go. I know the chat is very, very empty today. But, you know, to, sometimes you just have streams like that. You know, sometimes you have streams like last night where we had 10 people for, like, the entire stream. And then other nights you have strats like this where it's just me and a melodic and whatever randos that come that happen to come across us tonight. You know, just, just the way it is. I do know Forest Raider was talking about wanting to pop in here and play a couple of hunts with us. So, you know, I'm I, the, the potential for that exists, and that makes me excited. Tegrix is weak to ice, right? I'm not crazy. He seems like he'd be weak to ice. Also, I'm gonna take this tinged meat and slap one of these boys down. Slap this sucker down. There we go. Oh, I, kept, I keep forgetting to like change my set to Moonbreaker. Because Moonbreaker is awesome. Look at that Valor. Wait, oh, I got I got I got grounded. That's what happened. I got shaken. I was like, wait, why did my swing go through? Why did my Valor Gauge fill up? That's why. What a shame. Please don't hit me. Ah! Didn't know what to do. He he got scary there. I didn't know I didn't know what was up. Habash <laughs> and uh, I have confusion. I think that's that's the direct literal translation of that phrase. It wouldn't surprise me. Was a huge whiff. Big whiffies. One, two, three. Oh, big whiffs again. Oh, nice. Look at him move. Look at the way Monet Man rides that thing. So majestic. Boom, big tail cut. That's right, that was all me, baby. Never gets you tail cut, it's so cool. Taking that free tail. Because, you know, why not? Also taking that shiny. Because, you know, why not? I hope my meat is back by the time I come back here. Oh, nice. Very clean. <laughs> yippee ki -yay. Oh, what a great phrase that is. I don't know. Love that kind of stuff. Uh, I really got to start uploading the uh, full mods for all this stuff. That, that's something that I'm, like, falling behind on very, very heavily lately. 
And it's not even like, oh my god, stop poking me, you goddamn crab. It, it's just like, I haven't got around to it. I was working on, like, uploading 11 things last week, and then my internet crapped out. And all of a sudden, not a single one of those 11 things managed to get uploaded. And I was like, oh, this sucks. I'm working so hard on all that. All right, the tea has cooled off just a bit. Man, I want to like this tea so much. Like, I spent lots of money on it, but it, it's just so bitter. Honestly, this might be a tea I have to add honey to. <sighs> like, I don't, I like it. Don't get me wrong. Eh. What a shame. There we go. Already cut its tail. Amazing. I will take some credit for that. <laughs> DPS don't play. That is do, my friends. That is do. right there. That's right. Eat it! Oh, not a bad amount. That's a shame. I'm sorry, Monkey Man. I, I I feel your pain. One, two, three. Big boy slash. Another big boy. More big damage. So much big damage. Big sword go burr. <laughs> God, I love it. This, this, is, this is a good night. This is, this is a fun night. Good night. Nice, chill Monster Hunter night. That's, that's, that's what I needed. I actually thought about streaming a different game tonight. Um, I have a one-off stream that I plan on doing sometime in the near future. It's going to be fun. That was actually my first Grimclaw. Ah, well, you handled it well. Um, he's only got like two or three different moves from regular Grimclaw, and you just can't target the claws because you'll bounce like instantly. But like other than that, you know, basically it's Grimclaw. Except those two moves that you gotta look out for. Don't need that ration. There we go. No, that's not a bad fight at all. Honestly, I've been kind of powering through the Grim Claws as my Deviant Monster. I've got, like, at least eight more Deviant Monsters i got to, like, at least get to, you know, the, the, the big numbers. But after that, I'm, I'm very excited. Well, neither of those are good. Three, four, ninety-five. All right, I'm a lot of your turn to post. AKA Hermes. Monet, welcome. Thank you for the follow. Hope, hope your evening is going well. Thank you for hunting with us so far. Been having a great time doing this. I hope you've been uh, enjoying it all the same. 
Let me go ahead and uh, switch up my sets here for this particular monster. Actually, mm, I'm trying to remember. Is Raytheon, Gold Raytheon weak to ice? I feel like it is. But maybe it's more weak to, like, dragon or lightning. I can't remember. Everything's weak to sleep, though. <laughs> What a nice chill evening. It's like, I don't know, kind of kind of the, it's a, it's a perfect night for Monster Hunter. But tomorrow's gonna be a por for perfect night for Twilight Princess. That, that's what I think, or at least I hope. Yeah, that's actually perfect. I was, I was thinking I was holding everybody up, but this is actually a perfect opportunity for me to change up my specials and all that stuff. You know, the things that I do. Because as much fun as Brimstone Slash is, it's not nearly as cool as Moonbreaker. Moonbreaker is just, just a little bit more cool. The idea of being able to cut things in midair. The, the idea of being able to tear monsters apart, especially a flying monster like Gold Raytheon. I'm like, you know, it's flying around, it's doing its thing. I spin my sword two times and then smash it. Like, you know, absolutely destroy it out of the air. It's, it's the ideal Moonbreaker. Good. Man, I am enjoying this tea. And it's so good. I love tea. I love tea so much. It's 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 nice and a little bitter, but you know, perfect. It's exactly the kind of thing that you want at like eleven o'clock at night. That and maybe a soda. Lots of non-water fluids going through me right now, along with a lot of water fluids. I, I definitely like drank a ton of water at work today. Well, I biked in and it was very exhausting and tiring and all that stuff. But... There we go. What are we fighting? Gold Raytheon. Okay, I think it likes to spawn somewhere up and over here, like down here around the corner ish ish. Yeah, this feels right. Yeah, that felt right. Man, this monster can be such a pain sometimes. It's super scary and dangerous. Oh! One, two, three. Give me that big boy damage. Big boy meter damage. Oh my god, that did so much. Oh, and that's not a blight, that's a status. Very bad. Big danger. I wonder why the smokes, though. Smokes are not handy in this fight. Unless, like, we're fighting Silver, but Silver's not here. Get the ground. Yeah, there we go. Nah. Not a fan of that charge me. Another spin move. No! That's why this monster's scary. Yikes. Man, when it just does that kind of stuff with its tail. Oh no! It's wiping us all out. Everybody's taking a beating right now. All right, Herms, it's all down to you. Please don't faint on us as we all hurry back. Man, my roommate is being super loud tonight. I'm so excited to move next week. It's going to get nice and quiet, hopefully. You know, we'll have, like, ideal streaming conditions. Good internet, quiet room, all of that stuff. Maybe even I'll soundproof the walls. Who knows? Although, honestly, with the uh, current mic setup that I have, soundproofing the walls isn't super necessary. Would be nice. Believe me. It, it would sound so crisp. But, you know. Because, like, once the walls are soundproof, what... Oh, there we go. Wolf. 
That's all right. We do one redo. One redo on the failed hunts here. Man, that soda is ideal. So good. Okay, maybe not hyper gold red today. I think we could do it. I think it just like it caught a few of us off guard. Give it like a three, two, one, one and a half, one and a quarter, one and a fifth, one and a tenth. Good. There we go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm Monet Man. Hello, Monet Man. Welcome. Oh, yeah, one redo. Uh, I'm going to definitely change this blade. Actually, I'm just gonna change my whole set. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna play with a set that is gonna be more support based. There we go. I'm like sitting here going through everything. I was like, where is the set that I want to use? And then we want to use this guy. Oh, that's not meta. We're looking for chaos. There we go. Perfect. How's your night been going, Mark? Mark Monet. I'm just gonna keep calling you Monet because that, that that's like ideal. It works for both, you know, Twitch and this game. Let's see. Get this into the shot. I have high expectations of us. I'm gonna go ahead and eat for Fire Res and Moxie because this monster is super deadly. <laughs> cool. Lol. <laughs> This quest is a pain. Yeah, I agree. I'm not a huge fan of the gold and silver Rathalos, let alone the hyper versions, let alone the ones that are hyper and together, let alone the ones like, anyway. Like, I wasn't even a fan of like Azure, Azul Rathalos and like, you know, Pink Raytheon back in the day. Like, even those quests are just like, man, this sucks. <laughs> so gold and silver. I can't believe how many different colors of Rathalos and Raytheon we have. Like, I, oh, I'm so tired of it. All right, let's make this one happen. <laughs> right. Right, indeed. I hate gold and silver, but the stuff they give me is good. Yes, see, that that's, that's the hardest part. Oh, wow, look at this. Three of us spawning together like buds. Can't do it alone. Yeah, no, for sure. I mean, on it, well, there, there's like an aspect. I feel like I could event, like, I could do one of the gold or silver qu quests alone as long as it's a village quest, but I probably couldn't do one of these alone unless I was, like, really prepping for it because. God, this quest is hard. Super dangerous. Lots of scary monsters, all that stuff. Th this, this quest checks all the boxes of things that will kill you status, yes. Blight, yes. Big damage. Very, very much so, yes. Monster flies? Yes. Does it stun you? Yeah, I can do that. Does it have... Uh... The only thing that it doesn't do is tremor. Like, that's like the only weird mechanic that, like, this monster does not inflict on you. But other than that, it pretty much checks every single box. Oh, totally forgot to target it. Oh, what a rough start. For Herms. <laughs> I like the air dodge there. Get back, go back in. There we go. Putting it on the floor. One could say that I am a flooring monster. Ground with you. I'm gonna throw up some paras. Although I think Monet is also running para, so this should para pretty quickly, honestly. As I say it, throw in the poison, get that extra damage in. No! 
Oh, nice. Good combos. It's a shame that I can't drop this guy into a pitfall trap. Oh, that was bad. My bad. Mmm, drug. Yes, drugs indeed. No, no! I totally bailed into the next room. What a shame. Although, this is a good time for me to make face drain happen. There we go. Get back in there. Can we lure it into this pitfall trap? That would be awesome. Just, just, you know, just a thought. Let's see, did I bring my flash bombs with me? Because I would love to get the, the, the flash combo off. See if I can do it. Oh, how did that whiff? Would have been so good, too. The timing was right. The positioning was just ever so slightly wrong. Wait a minute. What's going on here? Hello? No, 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 no. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. No, that was not okay. Game, are you not registering our flashes? It's because of the smoke? Is this like newfound knowledge that I've never known before? It does, does, does the mist keep flashes from functioning properly? You know, that would actually make a lot of sense given the fact that Camellios does all the flashes. Or like, he, he always puts up a... Okay, you guys can stop flashing. I think I figured out the issue. But it would make sense that um, Camellios would put up... Like, when he, when he turns invisible, right? He always puts up a layer of smoke. And I think the reasoning for that is so that way you can't flash him while he's flying around the room like that. Money says, though, that um, I, I have money that if the room isn't smoked and he turns invisible, you couldn't be reflash him out of the air. That is my theory. I'm, I'm now I'm now 100% down to test this theory the next time we fight a chameleon. All right, now's a good time for some tea. Yeah, I definitely cut back on some of the tea leaves last time I made this specific tea, and that was a good idea. Because the flavor of this one is really strong. And like, if you use too many tea leaves, it's just like, it's it it's so like bitter. It's like 98% cocoa powder kind of bitter. Let's try. I mean, it's just a theory. It doesn't mean that it's true, but like, I, I money says that a flash would work as long as the room isn't covered in the mist. See, see, see. Look at this. A game theory. Hello, air. Putting you back on the ground. That's right. I, I I put you up right only for you to go back down there. Another arrow. Nice. I am a fan. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get another mount after this. Since I just got the mount. But I'm definitely gonna probably bump it up into like the half range. I'm a fan of. Oh, I couldn't quite get that air. Actually, I'm gonna just take a step back here. Nah, <laughs> don't kiss me. Kiss him. Oh, that was a hilarious trap. Big fan. That's right. I could go pro. Everyone, stop what you're doing. What, what's going on, Outcast? <laughs> Boy, I have arrived. Ah, I see. That is a very, very important thing to happen for the stream. So I, I, I definitely feel the idea. 
of having to just, you know, stop whatever you want to stop what you're doing for your arrival is important. Man, we are just like locking this guy into stun mechanics. It's kind of amazing. Not gonna lie. He still isn't limping though. That makes me worried. Are we even doing damage or are we just bullying Gold Brathalos? <laughs> yes, indeed. I feel like we're just bullying the monster. I feel like we've been like putting it in stun mechanics for like the past five years. Like if 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 I were doing a like if I were doing like a if I were to edit this particular fight, it would definitely have a stun counter on it and would probably come up to something to at least twelve at this point. <laughs> Danke für Hilfe. Thank you for the help. Oh, thank you for help, I guess. Or help? Maybe it's help. I can't remember. Oh, please don't do that to me. Thank you for letting me bounce off your head, Mizuki. Save my life. Ah, no, I got the full stun. Couldn't even get the half stun while you get knocked out of midair. Oh, big whiffs. No, oh, no, big deaths. I could die right here. There's a good chance I might. I just gotta, I gotta, I gotta full throttle that heal. <laughs> That's one of those situations where at that point it's just luck based. I got hit by it. I could see how much HP I had and my, my, my only solution was to just not even get, give myself a time to heal. Just, just go for it. You, you had to full commit, full send. If he didn't target me, it would have worked, but it didn't because he targeted me. What a shame. All right, let's see what I want to do. I could throw in some elemental coatings. I don't know how weak this thing is to dragon. Though. I think it's like probably five everywhere, like every other monster that's weak to dragon. Like, like how many monsters are actually weak to dragon except for Devil Joe? You can't, Devil Joe's cheating. There we go. Get that mount. All right, I'm gonna see if I can stall it so that we can get our teammate back in here ASAP. The struggle, gold and silver are always rough, indeed. Might be able to stall him. All right, that's, that's about as long as I can stall for. Over there doing math in my head. Let's see if I if I if I if I if, I, if it, I know it's combination pattern, which means it's gonna roll, which is gonna fill up the meter about a quarter of the way. And since I have about one, two, like a third of my meter still functioning, I should be able to get away with like about a tick of HP or stamina, whatever, whatever the mount thing is. The mount gauge? Yeah, let's call it the mount gauge. I like that phrase. What are we gonna do? Okay, not, no big spin move. No! What a, what a damn. That was going so well until he, we finally couldn't keep bullying it into lock mechanics. <laughs> re, re indeed. I just wanted some gold Raytheon tendies. pour myself some more tea for that i need some tea it's gonna heal my wounds rough all right monet man it's your turn three two one although since monet's in chat i can just say it here and then monet will hear me say it to him directly from chat and then with that combination of things happening at once oh skylight i haven't seen skylight cast in forever play this particular game maybe one day all right we're, we're switching over to airstrike because this set is just fun it's it's so dumb dumb fun
Ah, there we go. So lately, I've been thinking about like adding another channel points option to, to the uh, stream. Actually, there's a couple of them that I've been thinking about adding. Um, one of them would be just like a general mess with me kind of button. You know, as long as it's like within like as long as it's within the realm of possibility. You know, you guys could shoot out any kind of thing that you know could potentially mess with the stream. I'll put it on a timer or give it like a, a number of things that I have to do or something like that. And that might be fun. The other option that I've been thinking about lately <coughs> is the rant option, because my uh, I've been I've been talking to my brother for years. I mean, like since I was like since he was born, I guess, because he's younger than me. I need drop only from Teostra and Kushla, so this works out. Man, I'm melodic tonight. Is just your night. Apparently, you and Monet Man are just like on the same wavelength of quests that need to happen. Oh no, I can't lose my stamina here. But yeah, no. So, so one of the things that I've gotten very, very decent at over the years is like taking a topic and then just talking about it nonstop, like you know, continuous speech, a run-on sentence to the extreme. You know, just kind of keep on going with it, saying words out of my mouth until eventually I no longer have words to put out of my mouth. But that never really happens because my mind just keeps on running and it's course you know it's pace it just keeps on functioning in a way that allows me to talk non-stop and there's, you know it's something along those lines and like you know we, we could have anybody give me a topic just just any kind of topic and I will go on a nice short little 30 second to 45 second rant on whatever kind of topic that they want to hear me rant on oh look at all those explosions fighting the explosion monster with explosions Oh, please don't supernova me. That was scary. <laughs> Ooh, good Mount Herms. It's a perfect time for tea. But yeah, let me know what you think. Just a couple of ideas I've been thinking about lately. I like to see. Can you stop doing that to me? You're, you're kind of looking at me funny all the time. You're like jumping on me. Like the way you jumped on Monet Man. Well, all of those whips. Oh, no. I was like, should I dodge? I think I could walk out of the way. No. No, I couldn't. My slow-ass heavy bowgun self could not walk. An appropriate speed that would have gotten me out of that situation. What a shame. I could probably heal. Just a thought. Unless somebody heals for me. I should still probably heal. Just a little bit. Blast be deadly, man. Oh my god, no name man. He is just absolutely shredding you. I swear, every time I look at you, he's like trying to like blow you up with his strongest move or something. Teostra brand gunpowder tea. I'd be a fan. I would buy. Would buy. Easy. Easy purchase, actually. I do love me some gunpowder green. Although that is not what I'm currently drinking tonight. That's right, he supernova, I supernova. Just gonna sidestep him that time. Look at all them bombs. Oh, that is not the button I was trying to hit.
Although I do like how every time I screw up my combination list, it, I just end up like, uh, every time I screw it up, I, I end up like just waving at the monster. I'm like, yo, <laughs> please don't hit me. Oh, come on, charge in. Yes. I guess that hit. I mean, the mute, this, the sound went off. It just feels like it didn't hit. Oh no, Mizuki. Man, he's chasing all of us down. Uh, all those bombs with. Although I'm gonna say that I saved Herm's life with my with my with my bombs. My bombs rained down on Herm's and blasted him away from all kinds of danger. Is he gonna jump away again? No? Nope. Oh yeah, he is. Okay, that's fine. It's not like I wanted to hit you anyway. And this is the worst. He's just like running around individually jumping people. I'm like in the middle playing monkey in the middle with this guy. I just like, I want to hit you, please. There we go. Hello? Yo, Forest Raider, thank you for the raid. Party of 17, that is huge. How is it? How's your night going? Forest Raid, it's Jake. By the way, for those of you who don't know, Force Raider is a fantastic streamer. I highly recommend that you check out their stuff. They are also an MHGU streamer. I'm actually just going to go ahead and grab their link right here. Is what I would have done if my keyboard was plugged in. There we go. Now my keyboard is plugged into my computer. Highly recommend that you check them out because they are easily one of my favorite streamers to watch these days. So many people. <laughs> how goes the? Uh, how was the rest of your stream? What were you playing? Like a uh, Momomon or something like that? It's like this uh, Pokemon. I don't want to say ripoff because it looked really good, but you know, Pokemon ripoff. How are the hunts going? Oh, they're going great. We just totally carded twice against the Gold Raytheon. It's funny though, we were totally bullying it. I swear we got at least like 14 knockdowns in that one hunt and then we still lost. I'm, I'm like, my mind is blown as to how we lost that. Really good. Oh, Kodomon, that's it, was a bunch of fun. I'm glad to hear it. It looks really cool. It reminds me a lot of um the black and white games, like back when uh, black and white was the thing. which easily like in terms of graphics black and white was actually my favorite pokemon game like you know i i enjoy like the new kind of 3d aesthetic but i really miss the pixel arty kind of style of um, black and white it just it looks so clean let's see here oh yeah this is perfect just barely outside of that range yes i <laughs> barely connected Let me in there. Oh. But yeah, no, we definitely gotta we gotta we gotta play Monster Hunter again sometime. Or, you know, sometime in general. He's so much fun. Please don't oh my god, there's just explosions everywhere! It was like no matter where I went, there was another explosion waiting for me. In front of him, behind him, all around him. Teostra is kind of a kind of a scary monster sometimes. <laughs> oh god! What's funny is I'm actually playing like easily one of my most mobile sets in the game, like it, 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 that I own, in terms of just like moving wherever I want to at any given time. But it, it's not enough, I guess. I'm going to enjoy some more green tea, at least while these loading screens happen. I got a new teapot recently. Not by not by choice, but got a new teapot. I I'll show it off to you in the camera in just a second. I'm very happy with it, though. It's very, very cute, and I'm a fan of that. I love cute things, just as a, just as a general note. <laughs> Hermes pops out of the room so that way he can heal and then jumps right back in. Big scary move. 
Hermes jumps out of the room, heals, and then jumps back into the room only to get hit with a supernova. Summon Nidric. I don't know what this does. Well, you see, Nidric is a D&D character I invented quite some time ago. Now we're gonna be doing this for the next 10 minutes. He's a man of uh, great stature. Stature, stature. He has lived for many years. According to him, 42. But according to him as well, for the rest of his life, which is eternal. Nidric is always there, always existing, instantly regretting every moment of his eternal suffering, for he is alive all the time. So you see, uh, so I, I used to play a lot of D&D &D back on this stream, and this was the character that I invented, a very beautiful 82-year-old human rogue by the name of Nidric. And this is just the way that he is. You know, some kind of grumpy, stingy old kind of man of a, makes, makes a lot of a crackly noises and sounds like this. You know, there, there's a lot of old man noises, but this one, this one right here has to be my favorite. Ooh, this is a great opportunity to throw some bombs down and maybe even hit him with a perfect supernova. Perfect! Amazing! The best place supernova I've ever seen in my life! Everything worked out perfectly! I see that Rook is also in here. He's the other person who redeemed more need. Amazing! Tiostra never stood a chance against the air striking capabilities of the of the Babotage airstrike set. It'll be the last time we see it. For once Rise comes out, this uh, this set shall be put away for generations. Also, let me show off my teapot. So here we have a nice, cute little kitty cat teapot. There we go. It's very simple in design, but it's it's beautiful. I'm, I'm a huge fan. I went down to one of the local stores and was looking for something, and I found it in a cardboard box. I opened it up, had no cracks, and that was all that I needed. I think you hit me more with the supernova than the Tear Street or the bombs. I mean, that's fair, but I mean, supernova does big damage. I mean, let's be honest, supernovas are just gigantic. It's like the strongest move heavy bow guns have, if I believe. Besides like, you know, pierce crouching fire, but in terms of single shot moves, the strongest move. Maybe, maybe, I, well, there is that one. What is it called? Uh, void Piercer? But that one is terrible. Nobody should be using Void Piercer. I mean, honestly, what does it even do? It, like, destroys tails, I guess? But, like, I've never cut with tail with Void Piercer, despite the fact that I've hit monsters with it at least three times. I mean, believe me, it's, it, it's unconceivable. Inconceivable? No, that's not the right word. It's impossible. It's impossible to cut a tail with Void Piercer. If anybody has a video, which they don't because it's actually impossible, please send it to me. Which you won't because, again, it is actually impossible to cut tails with Void Piercer. Ooh, friend request received. I will, I will accept that as soon as the stream ends tonight. Thanks for hunting. Oh, well, thank you so much for joining us tonight. That being said, now we have one open spot. It is available to anybody who wishes to join us from the chat. But thank you for hunting with us. I hope you enjoy your evening. I hope you have fun with the rest of your night. I hope you've enjoyed being here with us, with Nidric, of course. And I hope that maybe perhaps one day we can hunt together again. Forrest, you were talking about joining us tonight, perhaps. Are you interested? Ooh, coal miners. Free charms for everybody. Everybody gets charms. This is not the set to be doing coal miner with. I mean, honestly. It's explosive against an explosive monster with hitboxes that hit the roof of the ceiling. That's a very, very dangerous combination, so to speak. We shall instead be using our brand new... Actually, you know what we're going to use? A sleep bomb set. 
because I love sleep bombing. It is by far one of my favorite things to do in any video game. I forgot to register the set that I used last time. It's very unfortunate. Where's my cold drinks? It's gonna be hot. Need cold drinks? I need large barrel bombs? And I need, of course, scatterfish. There they are. Register the set. And huzzah, we have a brand new sword and shield sleep bomb set. It shall be amazing, I hope. It could also be terrible. One or the other. We still have an open spot to anybody who's interested. Oh, there comes an AA. Sure, why not? We, we, we can make this happen. There's the Twitch. There's the name. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the hunt. Welcome to the hub room. All the good stuff that happens. Man, I cannot believe I'm still doing Nidric voice for the next five minutes. I mean, honestly. I guess we had two people redeem it unknowingly as to what it does. So, you know, to be fair, it's, 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 it happened. Not necessarily because people wanted it. But it definitely exists in case anybody wants it. That is the whole purpose of it. You know, we give people the option and the people can decide for themselves whether or not it's really the option that they want. I mean, you know, they, they select it, they go, man, this was terrible. Why would I do this to myself? And then they enjoy that for five minutes or hate it for five minutes, and then we stop. And then if they continue to hate it, then we can go ahead and always just have more people. More people continue to hate it and accidentally select it. And then we just have Nidric voice. Once every like 10 billion streams, when a new person jumps in, I believe it is probably one of the best, one of the greatest and dumbest things I've ever created. And honestly, if I'm being perfectly honest, this voice is so fun to do because it sits right in the part of my voice that's crackly and, you know, a little pingy and sounds absolutely horrendous. Which is just fun. You know, just, just, just pure, unadulterated fun. And that's what Niedrick is all about. Doing whatever he wants. Because it's fun. And of course, it's always for the money. I mean, you know, you can't live without money, according to Niedrick. Very, very literally. One day the DLD streams will come back, and it shall be a glorious glorious day. There we go. What if we can put it to sleep in the hole? That would be hilarious. Silly. But hilarious. Never mind. We woke it up. Putting it to sleep in the hole was not enough. Come on, you giant. Some monster that I should be comparing this monster to, but can't seem to be able to. Ah! I want to say it's kind of like a T-Rex, but it's not really quite like a T-Rex. It's more like a gigantic Velociraptor. In combination with, I don't know, something that isn't a Velociraptor. Because he's got like the tail of a Stegosaurus. The, the arms of a T-Rex. The arch and bend style of a Velociraptor. And the head of a Rhinoceros. It is quite the combination of monsters. One thing I've always enjoyed about games with monsters like these in them is that you kind of have to figure out what their, uh, how they live. Why do they do the things that they do? Easily one of my favorite games. 
is... Oh, what is the name of it? Pikmin. And the reason why I love Pikmin is because they do this whole thing where they describe certain monsters that exist in the world and tell you exactly why they exist the way that they do. For instance, why does this monster happen to breathe fire? Or how does it breathe fire? And apparently it will secrete a liquid that will shoot from its mouth and catch fire as it, as it, as it combines with the air. You know, it takes the oxygen and the liquid and puts the two together and destroys things. I am very sorry, AA, for your unfortunate loss. And there we go. The voice is over. We, we're, we're, we're done with Nidric voice. That was 10 minutes of Nidric voice. I don't think I've ever talked to Nidric voice for that long. In one sitting. Obviously, D&D sessions last longer than 10 minutes, but... I think you know what I mean. Please don't hit me! Thank you! Ah, just go a little bit short. Ow! Oh, he's, he's doing that circle thing. I don't know where he is. Okay, there we go. When he runs in a full circle like that, it actually terrifies me. It's like, I don't know, there's something about it that, like, is menacing and, like, very, very threatening to my well-being. Wow. Amazing. He, he stepped backwards. What a shame. We could cap it, in theory. Or I could just fire an alchemy bomb at it. That would, that would work, too. Actually, I have a great idea. Check this out. So the monster likes to hang out right around there. I'm going to fire an alchemy bomb right here. Go, my alchemy bomb. I don't think we connected. What a shame. Oh, please don't hit me with that. One of my favorite things to do while playing alchemy style is to see how many monsters can I can I make, can I KO with alchemy. Like with, with specifically an alchemy bomb. Oh, that's a that's a huge loss right there. I can make two more alchemy bombs. Yes. Yes. Yes! Alchemy fireballs. Oh my god. Big boy damage. Is he really is he is he leaving this room to go back up there? Oh wait, I see. What was that? He's like limping, he limps towards the wall, he starts climbing the wall, and then he climbs off of the wall to, 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 to come back over here so he can leave the area. But like, did he just juke us? He definitely juked me. I was not expecting that at all. And I totally ended up stuck on the wall as it was leaving the room. This, this, this Teo store might actually be a big brain. Oh, uh, where's my... There we go, I got one. There we go. Fireball! And another! Oh, what a shame. Oh, it was so close. The damage had to be so close. All right, abandon via subquest. Or exit end via subquest? Oh wait, actually I want the cars. Give me the cars. I, I am walking away from free Teostra stuff. And by Teostra, I mean Braccio stuff. Why would I do that? Brach is so good. There we go. Victoire. Although, I, I, though the way that it said the other two had exited via, like, just said exited, it makes me wonder if they didn't exit via subquest instead they just abandoned quest. Because I've definitely done that before and it sucks. 
you spent all this time hunting this monster, and then all of a sudden it's like, would you like to end the quest? Like, yes, please. Look at that. Look at that. He's got a broth gem. Not good. Yeah, not great. Not great. 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 Not great. Not great. Yeah, not great. Yeah, we'll take that. Ooh, that's actually... Hmm. You know, we'll hold on to that. Not great. Not great. Not great. Not great. Okay. Sell them all. Right now, I'm trying to make sure that my equipment box is not terrible. And it's a work in progress. We're, 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 we're getting there. As of right now, though, it's pretty terrible. Awesome. Whose quest was that? Was that Mizuki's quest? Who posted that? Uh, uh, chat log. Because I definitely said something earlier. Hello, welcome, sleep times two, thank you, bye. I want to say it was... Because, mm, like, okay, we did Herm's quest. I think it's my turn. I think, I think, yeah, it was Mizuki's quest. Let me go ahead and change up my set real quick, and then I will go ahead and post something. We're gonna we're gonna get the next uh, gem, or uh, what is it, Tigrex? Yeah, Grimclaw Tigrex done. That that'll be the next ideal thing. Also got the gem. Nice. A melodic. I love to hear that. I feel like everybody who comes in here and hunts with me always walks away with at least something that they're just like, "Wow, I got the cool thing." I'm like, "Wow, congratulations." Item set, turn set, and go with number 12. That's not right. Number 20. That, yeah, that's that, that's definitely right. Okay, cool. We got ultimate rice. What can I get for ultimate rice? Booty, Insomniac, Defender Kai. Sure, why not? Had a one of a kind texture. I mean, if it's called ultimate rice, I hope it does. Honestly, when you make like a perfect thing of rice, it's easily like one of the best feeling foods. I say feeling foods because it, you know you feel it in your mouth the way it just like the nice soft fluffy rice. It's it's amazing. And then when you make fried rice out of it, it's even better. I actually had somebody the other day. It's like, do you ever pop your rice? And he's like, what do you mean by pop my rice? And it's like the same way that you would make popcorn. Instead, what you do is you basically fry the dry rice in a pan until it like kind of cracks and then you make rice out of that I was like, that sounds very interesting i'm not sure if that's exactly something that i'm looking for in food but apparently it's something that people do and i'm gonna have to try it at some point because it could be great it could just be like the best way to eat rice who knows maybe it's like uh i don't know maybe it's got the texture of rice krispies or something like that who knows you might be able to make really good fried rice out of it, though. Always an idea. Greek and Chinese rice are always sickle mode. You know, that's that's that's. Fair. I personally am a fan of um, what's it called? I'm personally a fan of jasmine. Jasmine is my favorite rice. Okay, I guess you're not gonna scream. I was totally banking on you screaming right there, but you didn't. And that's okay with me. Ah, that was a big whiff. Another whiffs. Oh my god, did you see that reverse hit? I am sick. <laughs> Stop the monster in its tracks with my reverse hit. Blindfold. Oh, and then it got me. Another whiff. Big whiffies. Man, I'm taking all the damage right now. Just wanna just wanna pop, pop a couple of them first. Aids. That was not enough. I 
I hope that helps. I look forward to cutting off this tail with double A. This is going to be fun. Fun on the bun. Amazing. Amazing. Boom. Big tail cuts. That's right. Shut up. quite land that. That's a shame. God. This, this just this, this particular greatsword set is just way too much fun. It's so dumb how much fun this is. Just, just being able to run and instantly charge anything. I can get why there's so many greatsword users who like just to run the black set too because it's easy to make and does exactly what you want it to. It's just a great combination of things. I do kind of wonder if it can be used for anything else, but you know. Ah! Okay, okay. That's, that, you know, that's, 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 that's fair, I guess. It's not like I wanted to hit you. I thought I'd try and fully commit to it, but no luck. No dice. Oh, another big whiff. like swing your sword into like a giant thing full of everything like 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 there's just hit boxes there's hurt boxes all over the place and then you missed all of them every single hit that you're planning on hitting none of them happen all right i gotta hit the burn stun slash give me a second and it's gonna take all of my energy to do so I did not hit its tail like I was planning on, but I did hit something else. Big charges, one, two, three, yes! Oh, that was not enough to cut its tail, but it was massive tail damage. Nice, nice, well done. Super nice and fun hunts. I, I love it. I love hunting monsters like this. They're just so big and they move like, like, okay, okay. As a heavy bow gun user, I hate Tiger X. This monster is the bane of my existence. It chases you down to the end of the world and you cannot dodge it ever because it just keeps on charging you. And you don't move enough as a heavy bow gun user to just be able to dodge it freely. But when you got a set like this, oh my God, I get it now. Everybody always is talking about, like, yeah, Tiggy. I love fighting Tiggy. And I'm just like, what do you mean you like fighting Tiggy? This monster blows. And then I pick up a sword like Greatsword, like like a, like, like a Valor Greatsword. And it's like, I get it now. I, 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 I see. The, 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 it's been, I've been enlightened. <laughs> that was easy. Yes. Yes, it was. But not only was it easy, it was fun. Alright, and that might be it for my tea for the night. I got actually like, I don't know, a third of a cup left. It's not too bad. It's where all the, like, uh, the, 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 all the leaves that fall out of the uh, holder, and that's where they all end up. Ooh, an ancient shard. Don't mind if I do. I wonder what it could be. 
bunch of regular Tiggy stuff. Oh, that's a Wind Eater. Actually, you know what? I'm going to send these to my boxes. That way I can go ahead and recraft them into other things and then sell those things. In fact, now would be a great time for some charm loot boxes. I'm going to do that real quick. Man, I love that soda so much. I cannot believe it. That was not the right thing. I'm like the kind of person who like goes brain dead and just doesn't think anymore when he's doing things. And then as soon as I stop thinking and doing things, it just like I completely shut down. It's like, wait, what was I working on? Mm -mm -mm. Ah, mm. No. 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 You know, I'm, I'm keeping that one. Good Nessa. Yes. 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 Bomb boost plus eight. Mmm. That, that's, that's pretty close. Not blooded potential, charmer, defense. For a dead eye, crit status, and blight rings. Nah, nah. I already got a crit status set. If I was ever making one of those. Alright, now let's go ahead and make a few more of these. And then see, this is why we keep all of these extra charms that one might consider not to be great. So that way we can mend them, and then when we're done mending them, we can go, you know what? Yeah, I didn't want to keep that one around. Didn't want to keep that one. Nope. 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 Even though it's a three slot, it's only in health. Health is easily one of the worst things, in my opinion. Who needs health? I don't know. As, as I've been playing these games lately, I feel like I get to a point, and it's like, why would I, why would I invest in defense? Like... Ideally, I don't need to invest in defense. I just dodge everything. Which, obviously, that's not true. But, like, you know, the idea of being able to do that is something I very much so enjoy. All right, what are we hunting? Mm -hmm. Ooh. 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 Oh. Oh. Sure. We're going to be doing this hunt in just a little bit again. Maybe. If I ever get to it. I'm just going to go ahead and do me one of these. Item set. Go to my... Go ahead and just, just refresh my items. Refresh them all. Perfect. Amazing. That, that's exactly what I want. I'm going to go ahead and eat. And then I'm going to go ahead and run to the restaurant. Quick because all of this tea that I've been drinking is now passing me by. There we go. I will be right back. Give me about like, I don't know. G g g give me, give me a minute, two minutes. Two minutes max, one minute minimum.
Alright, I'm back. You say that this is our third Grimclaw today, but... I picked up the wrong control. My counter-argument is that this is actually our, um... Wait a minute, did we skip Herms? Wait, are we skipping your turn on Melodic? Who went before AA? I did. That That's why I'm confused. Sorry. Um, let me fix that. A melodic you post next. We'll get this quest done, though. You know, I, I free tickets, you know? That's, that's the way you got to think about it. Sorry, normally I'm, like, pretty good about managing these kinds of things, but I totally, I totally, I totally, uh, messed up this time. I was going to say screwed the pooch, but a friend of mine told me that he hates that phrase, and I only plan on using it around him. So, yeah. <laughs> Although it is slowly working its way into my headspace, apparently. I think I took the really dumb route. Oh, I'm taking a super dumb route. I don't even think this is the right area. I don't know. I, I love like I don't know. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be honest. I'm an annoyance, and I will continue to be an annoyance, and I like being an annoyance, but like only to a level of not making people want to kill me. I guess. In in regards to like it's it's I don't know it, it's it's fun to just kind of tease people. However, it's not fun to have people like oh my god, it's not fun to have people um be angry at you for it all the time. And that's something I do try to avoid. You know, you can be a little obnoxious, but like, just don't, just don't take it too far. Oh my God! Look at that! Just instantly, oh, filled up half my valor gauge in one hit. That's what I like to see. Hmm. What does somebody do? Is that a pitfall drop, I guess? There we go. In Valor mode. Big whiffs. Oh my god! Oh, somebody must have healed me. Because I took, like, no damage. Then move. Go in. One, two, three. No! Wow. Drew comboed me. Scream into throwing fists. Man, Rajang is such a pain in the ass. Ah! Oh, and there he is. Bailing out of that pitfall trap. Classic Rajang. There's like a couple of monsters that just like don't fall into pitfall traps, I swear. It's like him, Gawa, and like something else. No dice. Wow. I totally thought I was gonna circle around him. I think I've hit him once while I've hit him in Valor State, and that's that's that that's 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 sad. Ah, we traded. Not good, though. Not a good trade. I would have traded a level 3 charge, but sadly, that that just was not in the cards. Solid. I was actually thinking I was going to get hit by a laser beam. I was like, you know, I'm, I'm kind of standing here healing a lot, and I'm okay with this. However, you know, there's a good chance I'll just die to something. <laughs> Proceeds to just kind of die to something. You know, it's it, 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 the classic blunder. Yeah, another classic blunder.
I don't know. Rajang is one of those monsters, though. I, if, if we're dying to Rajang, I, I, I kind of just have to accept it. Because Rajang is just so rough. God, I keep on thinking I'm walking to the wrong area. Who? Oh, sorry. Thought I thought chat had changed. Nope. Not at all. Honestly, like, so in my opinion, one of the hardest things about streaming is keeping yourself occupied without a chat. Like, obviously, you don't want to just sit there and not talk. But obviously, it's very hard to talk without somebody to talk to. It's like it's a it's a it's a, it's a skill that I'm working on. Maybe one day somebody will be like, "Hey, you're really good at that." <laughs> and then I can say, "I got a lot of practice." Oh, thank you, Jane. For, for moving out of the way. This is a prediction. It was a bad prediction. Wow. Three big, like, slashes all coming down on this guy. None of them actually connected into anything that's good. Okay. Bounce. One, two. I, I'm just going to take a double there. I'm gonna just take a one shot. There we go. Boom! Nice. I think that's actually the secret to playing Great Sword. Is you just gotta accept the fact that you're not gonna get triple charges all the time. I, I'm I'm gonna start working that into my repertoire. Just just take what I can get. It doesn't always have to be the most damage, the longest charge, the anything like that. You you, you just gotta take what you can get. Sometimes though it is just charge after charge of triple, triple, triple. That, that that's that's the ideal situation, but sadly that's not the world that we live in. Fuku more carbon. I only got two. What? That was a very weak piece of ore. If it was only those two. Delicious. What are we hunting next? Gormagala. Yeah, I think this is where it likes to spawn. Could be wrong though. Honestly, I'm thinking back to, like, uh, MHGU as to where Gormagala would like to spawn. I want to say it's this room, though. Three, two, one. Oh, there it is. I was like, if it, if it doesn't spawn in, like, the next three seconds, we, we missed it. Yeah. Oh, I was so ready to take a trade there. But he didn't lurch forward at all. Just spat shit at me. Ah, what a shame. One, two, three. Three solid swipe. That screen, man. Oh my god. One, two, three. I do appreciate the affinity up, man. If you're gonna let me keep on triple charging your tail. Gonna have to take that stun, because my weapon is unsheathed. Or sheathed. It's currently sheathed. If it was unsheathed, that'd be fine. Oh no! Man, this monster is so much easier to hit with Ember Jang, if I'm being honest. Not saying it's the easiest monster to fight in the world, but like much easier to hit than Rajang. Rajang's up there isn't like hardest monsters to fight in Monster Hunter. Personally. Ah! 
No, no. That's a shame. That's a shame. What a, what a waste of Valor State. Also, I still want that tail. Oh, okay. It's that area. I'm over here processing. He's like, where is it going? Figured it out. Yeah. It has been so long since I've like played with people who just paintball monsters all the time, and I, I, I have a newfound appreciation for that. Oh, that is not the right area. Oh, wow. It's an area I haven't even gone. It, it's been so long since I've been to this area. Also, I'm going to need some, uh, I might need to go get some rations or something. Who knows? There he is. Why did I drop on him? Oh, wow. I totally managed to do that. Oh, man. You know, that didn't feel like it connected. It probably didn't. But it was so close. You, it makes you wonder. It's like, it did, did somebody else register that as connecting for me? All right, Shredder. That's pretty cool. Cortex. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Another Cortex. I don't know. Okay, okay, okay. Also, I don't think I got the tail. Judging from the giant explanation mark that exists in the other room, I feel like I, I must have missed it. Hey, Bobo, can you look at my dual blade elemental status currently? I don't know if I can currently, but I definitely can afterwards. You can look at your dual blade elemental stats, though. Should be in the equipment option. Or status option. Like me, I can I can do that. See, status. 55 ice damage. 55 ice damage. It, it, it's, a, it's a rather not great amount of ice damage, but it's a decent amount of ice damage. Out of here, you. All right, who's ready for some Grim Claw? I want that free car while we wait for it to show up. Look at that Jagai peel. Out bone. Bird wavering fang. Those are so useful. What did I not need? Carbonite ore. I got plenty of carbonite ore. All right, he's not here. Let's be honest. He did not spawn here. I'm gonna go check another room. You guys can go check other rooms after the hunt. Yeah. Okay. Gotcha. I will do that. I'm going to keep my... Oh, man, I really got to get rid of this. I can't believe we're all stuck with the frenzy virus. Oh, it's not here either. Oh, hey, hey, found him. There we go. Oh, man, that's a long walk away, too. What a shame. I do love like all the like little tricks that you can do to like keep your stamina going. Like if you get the chance, always run uphill so that way you can jump off of somewhere and then go back downhill. Oh my god, he's right there. Oh, that was a big whiff. Big whiffies. Hear you, I wanna hit you. Hermes, please don't die. I know it's very scary. Wow. I 
probably heal. In fact, I should probably heal everybody. I got my powders. Everybody gets heals. Ah! <laughs> okay, he's not looking at me anymore. He's gonna actually stand up. Oh my god, that rock. God, this guy does so much damage. Look at that. Look at that frame perfect ledge cancel. The weapon that is weapon the, the, the weapon with the problems of sheathing. And the style that has problems with sheathing. I canceled that into like a different animation and like Oh was ideal. Go big boy damage. Running up and around. One, two, three. Oh, big whiffs. Me and AA are in sync over there. Oh, I could not dive. Not enough stamina. Nice hit. Nice hit. So good. Love to see it. Oh, that's a mega potion. Never mind. No life powders here. There we go. <laughs> Me and AR are super in sync. That is amazing. The kind of stuff I love to see. That is my chance. I can feel it. Wow, I connected. I'm, I'm amazed, actually. Oh my god, oh my god. Wow. Okay, that's that's entirely on me. I totally thought it was going to throw in a forward boulder. Not not a spread boulder. I think we should capture this thing, honestly, if we get the chance. This monster's playing sketch. God, it sucks that I not have enough stamina. Yeah. It's always my downfall on these super long hunts. Just just not enough stamina. Working my way there, but just, just barely not enough ever. All right, I'm going to walk in here. Gonna throw a trap down here. Oh, well done. Maybe he'll do something crazy, like roll all over the place into my chalk truck. That'd be ideal. Or not. Okay. Let me go see if I can get this tail cut real quick. Awesome. Mission accomplished. 
ripped my trap, but you know, <clears throat> got the tail cut. You know, I feel fancy. Whenever I get a nice clean tail cut, I feel fancy. scale we can go ahead and ditch the Bukumore. I'd prefer to keep monster parts over ores because we I just got so many ores ain't nobody crying about Bukumore. Poor trap wasted. Just a little bit. It's all right. I'll, I'll get over it. Hopefully by next stream. Probably not by next stream. In fact, I'm, I, I'm going to promise myself that tomorrow when I start stream, I'm going to open up and just be like, man, it's a shame that shock trap didn't hit. <laughs> I'll still be thinking about it. Ah, look at all that stuff. Look at all that stuff. Ooh, a new record. New record. I always used to play uh, one of my favorite uh, one of my favorite Mario Party games is Mario Party 4. And I am part of that reason. Part of the reason is because it, it well, it's a, it's part of my childhood, but that sound right there. New record. Like it, 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 it sings to my soul just a little bit. All right. Um. Skip. You skip Hermes. Hermes, you post. There we go. God, this set is fun, but you know what? I feel like I should be using something else. I feel like it is time for me to look at my stats before you post. Okay, that's fair. Oh. 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 That's kind of neat. Fire and ice. Light proof. Elemental attack up. Solid. Elemental crit. Ooh. Challenge sheet. Okay, okay. And then Ruthlessness. Crit Eye plus two. Ah, there we go. Boom. And the Weakness Exploit. Nice. I wonder what the, what's the affinity on it. Also, maybe maybe you should... um, My, my, my only recommendation is instead of a challenge sheet, go for a... That's not how you say it'll, but that's okay. But yeah, no, that, that, I, I, the only recommendation I have is instead of going for challenge sheath, which I'm not sure how reasonable that is. Oh no, it's just part of this. Oh yeah, instead of challenge sheath, you might be able to go for uh, crit up, but that one's a really rough talisman to get. That's like the only thing that I might recommend about it. Though. That's like the only recommendation because you're already like playing a pretty good crit set. Yeah, no, I went with that because my sharpness wouldn't go because I have an extra slot. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I mean, that's definitely a good option for a filler, personally. Like, I love, I love she sharpen. I love uh, the one that charge char sharpens your weapon every time you dodge. That one's actually my favorite. Well, normally I play weapons that require a lot of dodging anyway, so it's like it's just nice to have not to worry about that. What are we hunting? I, I wanna, I wanna use heavy bowgun. Like a real heavy bowgun. Yeah, I can run heavy bowgun on this. Not worry about dying instantly. Maybe. 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 Where's my classic sets? Normal peak performance crit boosts. Select a weapon. Set decorations. Uh, 
And then we're just gonna run guild style. Like a like a like an OG here. We can run that and gunpowder infusion. Honestly, I might just register this. This could take up a new slot somewhere. I don't use this. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. I still need six more wings. After this one, I think I'll go to sleep because it's almost 2 a.m. Dude, that's totally fair. Honestly, I think I'm going to like do one more round of uh, hunts, and then that, that'll be it for me personally. I'm getting like, you know, I got plans in the morning. So, and I, I want to go biking as well. I, I'm just trying to bike as much as I can at this point. Love biking. So much fun. Are you serious? It's Provoker? Mm, mm, we're gonna go for Fruity. Alright, let's make this happen. <clears throat> we're gonna make this one clean if we can. Also, if anybody wants to join us after this hunt, uh, let me know. Because we'll have an open spot. Guys, I have no bullets. <laughs> oh, no. This is going to be so bad. Yikes. -oo. I guess I'm going to be using heavy shots the entire time. <laughs> oh, no. Can't believe I screwed that up so hard. Part of my mind was like, I know I'm forgetting something, but eh, it can't be that important. Totally that important. <laughs> Baho did an oopsie. Indeed. If anybody's got some random ass pier shots on them, let me know. That would fix a lot of things. That's all right. We'll run heavy bowgun next time as well. I mean, heavy shots are great for breaking wings, at least. You know, that, that'll, that'll be good. Wow, that went nowhere. I have not used heavy shots in a, in a hot minute, apparently. <laughs> Amazing. Fired one bullet, got hit by one bullet. Yeah, this is kind of a big oopsie, if I'm being perfectly honest. I don't even know what I'm going to do about this. Except, I don't know, do the best I can. I love it when I'm like firing practically at point blank and they still don't reach the monster. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and just pop a potion real quick. Help me out. Load up my gun. Knock him over. I love seeing nice, 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 um, nice aerial users because that was clean. Right, at least I'm doing like enough damage to keep myself like out of um, that one range. Oh, I broke the wings! Amazing. That was my goal. My, my, I, I've, I've accomplished the thing, guys. I did that thing I was planning on doing. <laughs> just, just shoot it in the face as it turns around at me. What a long reload time. Come on. Okay, I'm 
amazed I didn't get hit by that none of that. Right, I've got six dazzling shots. These are apparently pretty powerful too, so we're gonna we're gonna hope that these are strong enough to deal solid damage. I can't remember where the sweet spot on them is though. And that's the part that I always got. Like that's not it. Where's my sweet spot? Is it like super close up? Apparently not. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Maybe it's just crazy far away. That, that, that's the only other option I can think of. You gotta roll all the way over here. All right, now we just got normal level one shots, guys. Deviation on this gun is terrible. Totally forgot about that. Okay, I was gonna pop it, but no, nah, that's okay. I didn't need to. All right, guys, carry me the rest of this fight. That there's no other option. We're just gonna do the best that we can. Oh, that's right underneath us, isn't it? Amazing. Let me put myself in a corner. Man, please let this hit. It's the only way I'm going to do any decent damage. Oh, you've got to be kidding me! <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting blown at. All about that positioning, guys. And that's what's important here. Know exactly where it is that you need to be. Recognize what the monster's doing and know that that's not where you want to be. Like right now, I'm not in a good spot. Yeah, that's okay. We got away with it. Pretty decent. Okay, okay. We're doing okay ish damage, I guess, with normal level one. We could just be doing so much more basic damage. You know what's probably helping now? The, the peak performance is probably helping out a ton. Because that, 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 that's basically like a large attack boost. Come on. Nice tail type. Please don't hit me. Thank you. No, oh, man. Big smack. Oh man, everybody got heals.
I definitely remember the day I learned about crit distance. That was that was a huge game changer for me back in uh, for you. There, oh my god, there we go. What a dumb fight. I didn't have any ammunition. I used all my internal ammo and then I just proceeded to just poke it with normal level one shots. Like a good old heavy bow gun user. But yeah, no, I remember people were talking about critical distance. Um, and that was like a huge change for me when it came to playing uh, Monster Hunter. Because it's like one of those things that you just don't really, like, it, it's hard to figure that kind of stuff out. And then somebody was like, yo, why are you shooting the monster from all the way over there? Like, really? Like, well, what do you mean, why am I shooting the monster from all the way over there? Because it's safe. It's like, but you're not doing any damage. And I'm like, I'm not? And thankfully, I think numbers are going to really help with that. Like, the idea of you're shooting a monster, and it's actually, like, across the map from you, and you just keep hitting ones, that changes a lot. I got a ton of clips, two or three being just me get, getting sniped by Grimclaw. Yeah, Grimclaw is pretty hilarious. He does a lot of stuff. Man, I got the hiccups. All right, you said that, that was the last one for you, though, Melodic? Stretching out my hands, lots of chaos scales. And not get a single wing myself. Could have sworn I did damage to its wings, too. I was like, man, I should get at least a wing. <laughs> I hope you got all of my wings a melodic. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately. Yeah. G heavy bowgun. There it is. And of course, I also didn't get a single wing, of course. Alright. Well, thanks for hunting with me tonight, Omelotic. Um, if anybody else wants to um, hop in right now, now is the chance. I won't be streaming for too much longer, but I plan on streaming at least, you know, for another cycle of the room or something like that. We have two open spots as of right now. We're doing this quest. So if anybody wants to come and join us, now is your chance. <laughs> Stroke. Yeah, nice hunting. Oh yeah, for sure. I absolutely love. Yeah, it was a lot of fun tonight on Melodic. I hope you had a good time. I'm gonna at least eat for Thunder Res. Man, this monster's scary. Slight stroke. We're gonna we're gonna wait for a couple more people. If they're gonna pop in tonight. If anybody in my chat wants to join me, again, let me know. Now is your chance. We have two open spots. Lots of room for anybody. Any and everybody. Had a great time. Glad to hear it on Melodic. I look forward to hunting with you in the near future. Not tomorrow though. Tomorrow's Twilight Princess. But in the near future. Actually, I'm thinking, like, these next two streams are going to be the end of Twilight Princess. We got, like, one stream tomorrow where I've got, like, a dungeon and a half to take care of. And I got another stream the next day, which I'm probably going to beat the game by then, hopefully. That is ideal. Whenever my internet isn't complete dog shot, it's a great time. I'm glad. Yeah, I agree. I, I heavily agree. Oh, and there's two people right there. Welcome. Here it is. Got a couple of people. <laughs> that is a set. Are they running alchemy? Aerial. I see. I mean, aerial hammer is sick. Don't get me wrong. So, the, you know. But I can, I can kind of tell that they're, they're, they're a world player. Just a little bit. Nothing wrong with that, but just a little bit. Clearly, they maxed out their attack. In fact, they're about four points over an attack. All right, let's make this happen. This scary combination of quest. I also told Fuzzy this. I won't do go into much detail, but I can continue tomorrow. Mm, like my math teacher is. Oh wow, your math teacher is an actual pedo. I see. That 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 is worrisome. Just a bit. I would be careful about throwing that around, but like, yeah, that that that's a little messed up. 
I joked about him being one, and he was a sexist and a simp, and he's actually a pedo. I see. All right, we got we got to lure them to two separate gates. But yeah, no, I, I'm sorry to hear that. I mean, that that that's weird and blows. All right, uh, all right, let's separate them. This is our chance. Everyone over. Guys, pick a side. Okay, Ikamuka got absolutely shafted there. That 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 is a shame. <laughs> Oh my god, please don't. I just want to go into my regular old crashing fire. I haven't been in crashing fire in years, it feels like. No, I'm actually gonna I'm gonna stick with level two shots for right now. I'll move my way back into crashing fire in a minute here. When opportunities arise, I will go into crashing fire and absolutely blast this thing with shots. I will say the beauty of using guild style and like heavy bow gun is that you're never on a timer. You're just you're just firing shots. Whenever whenever you need to fire a shot, you just fire a shot. Go for it. You know what I mean? And I love that. That that's easily one of my favorite things about using this type. I used to brought ammo this time. Indeed, I did. I was very, very, very much so prepared to bring ammo this time. Man, he did mad damage though. I will not be able to get any sleep shots off for the time being. Also, I picked up a tinge of meat. I should probably just slap a couple of these on the ground or something. Just in case the monster gets hungry. Bust that out. Get that off. Bigger damage. Are you serious? What did I get hit by? Ridiculousness, apparently. Wow. Wow! <laughs> I thought that was a boulder. It was. It was. It was a whole verjang. Once we take care of one of these monsters, I'm gonna feel a lot better about this one. No! Who keeps doing this? <laughs> the fuck did that come from? I'm gonna get hit with something dumb. Called it! I fucking called that shit! Now that I think about it, the entire school's sexist girls get special privileges, like free points. Being allowed to use phones in class at recess, getting put first in every single line, getting jail out of free cards every time they do bully. They do even if they bully. If it's a guy gets bullied at school, nothing. If a girl gets bullied, immediate action in court. Yeah. I don't know, it's, yes, yeah, literally legal court. I think that's a, um, there's a couple of hard things to say about that. 
Because I, if from everybody I've talked to, like, I don't know. I'm definitely on the everything should be equal train. You know. Oh my god, this Rajang is absolutely fucking up. And he just freely ate that meat, no problem. Did not care. Um, but yeah, I'm definitely on the, like, people should be treated equally kind of train. And that includes, like... Obviously, as of right now, though, like, most situation, girls do not receive equal treatment from uh, anybody. And the and the equal treatment that they're getting... Or no, no, no. no and, and, that, and, and what I mean by that is that they're not being treated the same as guys in a very negative way in most circumstances. So it's very hard to say, like... But, like, you know, that, that, that's very, very politics-based. I would say that in this very specific situation, that is very bizarre. And I guess, like, it, it, it's definitely important to be sensitive about those kinds of issues, but it should be sensitive for, for everybody, not necessarily just the girls. If that makes sense. That's the way I look at it, at least. Man, I swear to God, nobody plays guild style anymore. It's a shame. It's so much fun. It's slow. Don't get me wrong. Like, it's very, very slow. But, like, I don't know. That's kind of the beauty of it. I'm all for definition feminism, but not very modern definition feminism. I mean, yeah, I, I, there, there's a couple of groups that definitely take the idea of feminism and twist it to their own desires in a way. But, like... It's, I'd prefer that to exist and still, like, try and fight for equal feminism versus just saying that all of feminism is stupid, if that makes sense. I'd rather have both groups than none of the groups. If that makes sense. Like, ah, yes, you're oppressed, so now we will oppress you. Yeah, and no, that's not the way it should be. Um, that, that, that's exactly what led to... Uh, that, that, that's, that's actually very close to what caused uh, Nazi Germany to become a thing. From what I've, from, from, from what I've been researching. Because, um, like... Oh my God, get off me. And the reason why I say that is, like, um, it's like fighting racism with racism. Oh, wait. No, but, like, um, what ended up happening, like, in that circumstance is that if you... If you force people to pay, they okay. So here's what happened: World War One happened, Germany lost. Um, Germany lost, and all of the that all the Axis powers also lost. Um, but th at that at that time and period, Germany was the only place was was the only country with money still. And what happened is the Allied powers forced Germany to pay back like major costs of World War One. Like, you know, you know, paying for the amount of... Oh, I got the shaft this time, I think. Oh, no, no, never mind. Never mind. We just split up. Um, oh, no, wait. Somebody else got shaft. Yeah, Nika. I'm sorry. But so so after Germany had to pay back all of these things, the, um, the country was left, like, completely in shambles. Shambles. Um, their economy was screwed up and, like, all of that stuff. And people were desperate, which allowed people like uh, like Hitler to rise to power. Um, and so, I don't know. I'm definitely of the mindset, like, yes, we need to fight for equal equality. But fighting for equality does not equate to punishing, like, like does not equate to treating others in a way that would put them in a far worse situation. Which is a very hard thing to, like, balance and say. Because, like, obviously there's some things that I, I think need to be taken care of right now in, my, in our current politics. And I am a little bit, like, abolish X system sometimes in my, in, my, in my personal thing. But, like, there's also a level of... I don't know. It, it's hard. It's really, really hard. Politics is hard. Let me put it that way. <laughs> oh, please don't hit me with that. And, the, and there are aspects that I feel are hypocritical, but like, for example, okay, okay, here, here's a great example. Um, during the raid on the White House that happened with a lot of the um, Trump people, 
Um, what ended up, like, the, the police force ended up doing something, like, it, they, 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 they escorted people off the premises, they did all these things, and a lot of people are pointing out the fact that the people who are, like, the people who are doing peaceful protests in places like New York and New Orleans, or at least were, and they were getting, like, practically maced and shot and all this stuff. Like, you know, all of that stuff is happening in, like, New Orleans. Like, that, 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 like, or uh, New York and stuff. It, it's a huge problem for that possible campaign. And the fact that the Trump supporters did not, res like, and then people will be like, but why did they get only, like, why, why, how come they're getting escorted off the premises and stuff like that? And what, what the issue is, it's, it's not that the police should treat the Trumpers the same way that they treat the protesters. It's the exact opposite. Peaceful protests should not be treated, you know, like, you know, we, we shouldn't have cops that are quick to pull guns on anybody. That, that's like the moral of the story there. If there's going to be feminism, I would sincerely love it to be in Eastern countries where women are treated as straight fair. I mean, I, 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 that's a rough one. I think we should just be doing the best that we can where we are first. Um, getting, for me, getting, getting too involved in foreign politics, like, of course there are things that I want to fight for in, like, certain situations. However, I want them to be able to fight for it themselves, not to necessarily enforce rules on them that, like, I don't, I don't want to be enforcing rules on other countries as not being a part of that country. That, that's something that we shouldn't be doing. For instance, when people were going around being like, wow, communism is really bad. And then they'd go to other countries and be like, wow, you should be, you guys should be democratic. And then like, or you guys should be Democrats or, you know, whatever, whatever our country system is. It's like Republican democracy or a party. Anyway, you know, when we went around doing that to a lot of countries, it actually messed up a lot of countries. And so I'm like, even though like there are definite downsides to communism, I, I want, I don't think that that's our business to be like, wow, let's go over there and instate democracy. Like that, that's, that's not the move either. Cause we got so many issues here first personally. And I'm not, I'm not going to be like, I, of course I, I want feminism to exist. Obviously i I myself am a feminist, but you know, at least I like to think I am. I hope somebody, if, if I wasn't doing that, I hope somebody would call me out on that really, really hard. But it, it's far more complicated than just saying things and hoping that it gets better, if that makes sense. Very tricky situation, though. Again, for instance, in, you know, in the very local circumstances of, let's say, your school. You know, you're saying that, like, they're getting jailed of free cards, and, like, even if they get, like, and if they get bullied, they'll go to, like, court cases will happen. And I, 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 can, I can say that some of those things are kind of extreme. However, I think, depending on, like, the level of bullying, that, that definitely has something to play into it and all that stuff. But I'm saying that, like, people, like, that doesn't necessarily mean that they should be treated like the boys are. And, you know, I, I just think that it, it should go both ways. Everything should go both ways. That's that's kind of wh what I feel. Just treat everybody respectfully. <laughs> treat every person like they're a real person. And what I mean by that is, you know... Learn about the individual and then treat the individual like you would a person. Like, you know, like, like like you would treat them. Like, you know, for instance, I'm melodic. I treat you like I'm melodic. I don't just treat you as whatever. You know what I mean? It, it, it gets really complicated. Uh, let's see. What do I want to post? Uh, do I want to do this quest or this quest? I, I don't want to fight a tiny monster. I want to fight a big monster. Let's do this. This looks like fun. 
Trust me, bullying, the, the bullying thing is from my personal experience. Uh, we're just doing our running. I got bullied for my height for six years. I told the school every day they did nothing. I told my parents, and the school denied everything. Yeah, and that, that that's really messed up. But that sounds like far more of a that, that that sounds like a huge issue with the school itself. Not necessarily because of all the girls in the school. My mental health went to shit. It wasn't about my height after the first three years. Yeah, I I, I understand. I mean. I've gone through my fair share of bullying when I was a kid, and it's not fun. It's super rough, honestly. It sucks. You got physical after a while? Yeah. No, I mean, like, again, keep telling the people who you need to know these kinds of things. For instance, your parents. Your parents are probably very good people to talk to. And keep confronting your teachers about it. Like, don't stop. If it keeps happening, you guys got to keep... You, you gotta keep calling them out on it. Cut to a couple months later. Yeah. This is, this is a situation that, like... It goes a little over my head sometimes. But, like... You, you can't just, like, stop. New student comes in, she's shorter than me. Gotcha. Yeah, see, and that, 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 that's, that's a little weird. I feel like the fact that they completely ignored your situation and then was immediately responsive to her situation, that is, that is a little bit, that is messed up, but that's on the school's end. Um, but I, again, it, the, the issue isn't that they took notice of her situation. The issue is that they refused to see your end of the situation. And I think that's, that's what's most important is that should there be a case of bullying, there should be something done about it. Not ne not necessarily a court case. Court cases are very messy things, but like something should like be said, you know. Obviously, the girl won because there's hard evidence. Kid's parent ends up paying like six hundred dollars fee if I remember correctly. Gotcha. Switching to couple three shots. A big mountain, but yeah, no. Again, it, it, the the issue. I think another part of it is like, if the parents are able to take somebody to court, that's another issue. Because again, court is very expensive. So of course, like you know, it, it's not it's not to be said that like your court your 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 case could not have also been taken to court, but like, I I think taking it to court is a little bit too serious. <laughs> In my opinion. One last we are. I'm not I'm not stopping this pepper. Actually now I am. You're, you're scaring me a little bit. <laughs> the Lazios shoulder bash. How terrifying. Yikes. Big monster do big damage. But yeah, no. Again, I think in, in your situation, the best thing that you can do is just keep telling people. Oh my god, that crab saved my life. And yet the jail out of Frio card is this very recently.
Very recently, I got bullied by this girl for like three months and told the school regularly. Okay, so there, there's a couple of things that could be happening in this kind of situation. Um, oh my god, he just flattened me. And that's, um, again, like I said earlier, court cases are super messy. And what can end up happening in those specific situations is that, like, if she has the power to take people to court over bullying, that's something that I'm sure the school is currently trying their best to avoid. So it's not necessarily that she's a girl and that's like the issue um, that gives her all this free reign. I think it's something else beyond that, personally. I got sick and tired and threatened the girl, basically saying I would break her nose if she didn't stop the bullshit. Mm. And then I get in trouble with the school for threatening a girl. That I that I get that I would get in trouble. It makes sense. Yeah, but it also doesn't make sense that she would get away scot free. I do understand the situation. I do think though, however, it's a little bit beyond the fact that she's a girl, and I think it has something else to do with the way that the school. Again, it, so to take somebody to court requires a lot of money, a lot of like. There's, there's levels of power that come into the ability to take people to court. I don't stand in a position where I could take anybody to court right now. Personally, that's a really... I'd much rather talk things out and work things through. Because that's a super expensive thing. Um, and the fact that she has the ability to do that... Um, is something else and I think it's beyond her being a girl she could be a guy and still be in the exact same position I believe but still no punishment to her makes it just carry a sting of depression no yeah and I, I I totally understand that I'm sorry that it's like that it shouldn't be like that but you know I will, I will say that I, I think it has much less with her being a girl and has a lot more to do with her family's position and the ability that she has to basically do what she does, if that makes sense. Again, it could be a guy and he could be in the exact same situation and the school might handle the situation exactly the same. I think it has very little to do with her being a girl. But I do believe, like, again, the situation that you're in is messed up, and I apologize for that. There's not a whole lot. Besides just continuing to call people out on that, you know, let your parents know about it and talk to them about it. Like, the, that, that, that's the best thing that you can do right now, is let people know. Get people on your side. You know, even even if it's like just like your close friends at school or stuff like that. I totally forgot to restock on bullets. That's all right. They'll last. Am I crazy? Does it not spawn here? This is for my personal sanity. I just want to check. Okay, 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 okay. But yeah, no, I'm sorry about your situation, man. That that really does blow.
Big damage. I'm gonna try my best not to cart this time. This monster is very, very scary and big and does a lot of things. It looks like everybody else is also feeling exactly the same way I am, given the fact that we all just pop life powders. I really wish I could hit this monster with long range, but oh well. Yeah, we kind of raided the main office my entire class, and they did nothing about me getting bullied, and they wouldn't listen to 20 plus fifth graders, so we just stopped trying with the group strategy. I mean, yeah, but like, you, you gotta just keep on harassing the office. Again, um, what the office can't do is ignore you and your friend's parents. Like, there's, there's like, you know, if, if you tell your parents about it, and you're in like, Everybody else, if, if, if people keep on complaining, something has to be done. Is generally the situation. So don't necessarily stop. But at least keep on calling her out. Or at least keep, yeah, keep calling her out to other people. That, that's my, that's my advice to you. That's the, that's the best advice I can give in this situation. It's not a, it's not a situation I personally have been in. Um... Like, again, I, I've been bullied before, and there's, like, there's things that you can personally do to deal with that. Um, but, like, there, there, there's, besides constantly telling people, there, it, it takes it takes people to make things happen. Is he jumping on me? Totally made him backpedal into that trap. All right, let's get this. Let, 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 let's get this rocket guy finished off. I, I can tell that we're really, really doing the damage right now. God, that barely whiffed me. Very, very dangerous. Ah. I will say, hopefully things just get better in middle school. Um, middle school can be... But I promise you, as 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 things pa as, as time passes, things will get better. You you'll you'll get out of that situation. I hope and you'll be able to like I don't know, have a better time in like high school and middle school and stuff like that. special that's what i love about gunpowder infusion it's like literally something that you should just use as often as possible as often as possible like you know it, it's just man i want some powered up bullets and then it just carries it carries over forever unless you're about to die in which case don't use it because you lose it but like it's an okay stuff Okay. Okay. You know we take those. Monkey, get out of my face! Trying to do damage here. Then go ahead and just pop it. Potion. That's like 
back up to max damage. There we go. Got that resuscitate. Our peak performance going on. Big dangers. Ah, got the screen set. Nice knockdown. Going in the pop special. Oh, you, you little bug, you better not touch me. Oh, you touched me. Shots. We could try and sleep on it. I don't know if these people know what sleep on is, but we, we can we can find out. Oh, apparently not. Almost everybody knew about sleep bombing except for one dude who just just plowed in there. Ooh. eating all the bullets. He's just eating every hit. He's gotta be, he, he's a tanky, tanky guy. Shiny. All right. I don't know if that was a limp or not. That, 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 that. I haven't fought this monster often enough to like read all of his tells. I can just play safe enough away from the monster for the most part without dying. But beyond that, I have no clue what this guy's like supposed to be doing. Please don't get me closer. Please. <laughs> it's fixed now, but I took them. But I. But it took them from when I was in sixth grade to when I'm in ninth grade. Gotcha. Yeah, that is that is pretty rough. I'm, I'm I do apologize for that. I'm glad that it's better now though. Again, sometimes it does just take time, which is really really unfortunate. Right now, I'm kind of in my waiting period, just waiting for things to happen to me. But that's mostly due to like COVID stuff and all that stuff. All right. Let's see. Whose turn is it next? Also, I gotta buy more bullets. Don't let me forget that. The bullets are very important. Oh yeah, Twitch ate my message. Oh, did it? Dang, sorry. There's not a whole lot I can do about Twitch eating things. That didn't make sense. Mmm, gotcha. Well, I am glad that it's fixed now for you. Like, that, that, that's important. I'm glad that it's getting a little better. Build your turn. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and run to the restroom again. Uh, I will be right back. Give me, like,. Give me a minute.
shame I spent way too long learning that. The only thing that he fixed was a water fountain, so don't get your hopes up. Gotcha. Well, I will tell you this. College is fun. It can be fun. And honestly, life outside of college is also a lot of fun. I've been having a lot of fun lately. Huh? <laughs> Me too, looking very spooky. Are they? I haven't actually gotten to look at them. Looks like Guildman is eating, so they're, they're probably going to post a quest right after this. Let me see. Is there any specials that I want to change out for other specials? Always an idea. Things I could do. Mm. You know, it's funny. I do this like I don't know what the specials look like, but I know exactly what specials look like. I'm like, oh, I wonder if I could do something like this instead. It's like, but what? I already know. Hunchback Godzilla. Post it. <laughs> Who is Nidric? You know, Nidric is a. Uh... Nidric is a D and D character that I came up with, um, and I often play. It, which is the character that I use currently on the streams for when I get to do D&D &D streams. They haven't been happening recently, but also Godzilla's. Um, but yeah, no, Nidric is a is a is a D and D character that I came up with. He's a 72 year old bard, human bard, and he, yeah, he's he's eccentric, so to speak. He's immortal as well, or at least believes that he's immortal. Also, is there a sub chat only? Because I always send messages in sub only chat, and it gives me this itchy feeling that I don't know how I have to access it. Uh, there shouldn't be a sub only chat. I think the closest thing to it would be uh, the Discord, I guess, but like everybody's there. The channel rewards? What? Oh, weird. Um, uh, let me get rid of that. That does not need to exist. <laughs> Let me see here. Sub only chat. Where's that at? Channel points. Oh, wait, go back. Can't believe that's an option in here. Yeah, there. Now it's gone. Don't know what that is. Now we don't. Now you don't. Now I don't have to worry about what that is. I saw proof of existence right before my eyes. The existence of a uh, sub-only chat. I'm glad nobody has ever redeemed that option. Nor should they. It's a silly option. Why should, why should I only, like, the only reason why I should ever have a sub-only chat is if the chat becomes so large that I cannot ever possibly hope on reading anything at all. 
That, that's the, the only reason. And even then, I'd probably make it a followers only chat. Or like, you know, but again, like, you know, we have, let's say, 10 people in chat right now. Just a random number I'm throwing out there. So far, I've seen posts from Unmelodic and Donnit. And you guys are the only two people I've seen post in chat, which is, you know, that's fine. You know, lurkers are what keep the stream alive. Also, what are the options for the new channel rewards? Oh, what were the options for the new channel rewards? Um, I'm working on two of them right now. One would be a just some random challenge that you give me to do on stream. It could be while I'm playing a certain game. It could be about the certain game that I'm playing. It could be, you know, go do some push-ups or whatever. As long as it's within reason. I always have the ability to veto anything, but then my veto also means that you guys get to pick another option. Um, the other idea that I've been having recently that I'm far more excited about is the idea of let me see i had the idea what was the idea it was something it was something and i was very excited about it one hour prance party like ranger no it was um oh what was it It'll come back to me. I should have written it down, honestly. The more I think about it. That was a special one. Ooh, this one's gonna be rough. And then let's obviously use some ice. Starting a rant, boom, yes, that was it. Starting a rant. You give me any topic to rant about and I will go on a rant about it. Whatever, whatever kind of, um, Thank, thank you. Thank you, Omelotic. That, that was perfect. Um, for pretty much any, like, I, I, even if it's a topic that I know nothing about, I can pretend to know something about it for at least 30 seconds and talk indefinitely until eventually the sentence becomes so long-lasting and rambly that, like, it, it's just nonsense. But that, that, that's kind of like the, we'll need some insurance. Uh, good luck. <laughs> But like, yeah, so that, that, that's, that's the idea of that one. Thank you. Thank you, Omelotic. I'm writing that down, actually. Where, where's my pencil at? You know, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna put in a Word document somewhere. Uh, 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 start. Oh, that's right, my, plug, my, my keyboard isn't plugged in. You know, I have Twitch chat. Twitch chat will keep me in check. But yeah, no, that, that was um, the other, that was the other idea. Did I take an extra? Yeah, I totally did. Whoops. Because, like, I don't know. It, it's something that I personally enjoy doing, and it's also something that could be considered entertaining. I actually... So, there was somebody I was hunting with the other day, and their name is Imperial Sun. And for a while there, apparently I sounded very distorted in their chat. We were doing a bunch of sound checks to make sure that everything sounded correct and all this stuff. Um, and every time they asked me to do a sound check, I would just go on one of these kind of random-ass rants about anything and I would just sit there and I would talk for like 30 seconds non-stop about anything and the the, the uh, and it ended up being kind of amusing and funny and sometimes it wasn't sometimes it was but I figured it would be a fun little channel rewards option if people ever wanted to force something which for me it's you know it, it, it's it's good for me because it lets me think of my toes and all that stuff something new to try out you know I've also, so I have a number of uh, books full of poetry. We could do uh, another another option that just now popped in my head, which I used to actually do once per stream, is a poetry reading. Where you give me like a number between like one and a hundred, and I will flip to that page and read whatever poem is on it. Oh yeah, I think I hunted during that stream briefly, or just disconnected midway through a hunt. Yeah, that might have been it. I do plan on doing more, um, more 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 uh, co-op streams in the future I have a number of people who I still want to hit up I got people I want to play with again you know playing with Dranger was super fun um, there's so many good Monster Hunter GU streamers out there right now and I would love to play games with all of them personally I, I still want to play games with Forest Raider which I have to hit in Discord hit, hit up in Discord sometime if they're down for it. 
Please don't hit me with anything crazy. Hoping that this DPS is good. I, it has to be, right? I'm like, I'm like critting like nearly every other shot. It's Pierce level three shots. It's crouching fire. I've got gunpowder infusion going on. All that stuff. DPS has got to be pretty good. It's heavy bow gun. <laughs> this is the big boy damage weapon. Out of some of that. I'm gonna chill on this rock real quick. Hit you with the supernova. There we go. Oh, I see he's in Valor State. Me, I'm just kind of chilling with my with my base DPS. You know, you know what? That's okay. I'll take that damage. It was worth it for that bullet. As long as whatever he does next does not kill me. Good. The RNG ice scope did not kill me. knows what they're doing. I know it'll take a bit of coordination with Mario Kart 8 stream, but with MHG streaming still in the work, I would absolutely love to do that. I've definitely got to talk to all the right people. Because, um, like, I can think of at least seven different uh, MHG streamers that I can think of off the top of my head, let alone the MHG streamers that, like, other people know as well who would be interested. Like, even the person who recommended the thing, I haven't met yet. Like, I have not popped into their stream, which I hope to do something. But I haven't yet. I'm curious. Did you cook the Caribbean meal I, I told you about? Not yet. Um, I, I So right now I'm currently working my way through my fridge. I'm moving very soon. And my goal is to not have any food that I need to transport from this house to the other house. So it's going to be at least a week and a half before I'm ready to go ahead and commit to that. Because right now I have a whole pot of beans I'm like working my way through. And I prefer not to have to make a pot of rice. Although if I have to, I will. And I, I honestly, the, the fried bananas, that's, that's the thing I'm most interested in. Which I do in fact plan on doing at some point. And then I also need the, uh, what is it? The, 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 I need the kind of chicken that you're talking about. Man, that was, wow. Man. Food transportation is funky. Yeah, exactly. And I'm trying to make sure that I don't have anything in the fridge, like milk or yogurt or eggs. Um, the most important things that I, like, I, I have like a 20 pound of, like, bag pound of rice. That's going to be fine. Don't need that. Uh, is this where Ika Matsumi goes? All right. It was a fantastic hunt. I wish that they would pop into the... If, if they are in the chat, I hope that they are willing to come back and hunt with me again because this was super fun. I am surprised at how well this particular hunt went. To be fair, though, we were totally pumping up the damage. Like, look, look, look at the damage on this gun. I just, want, I just want to throw it out there. I'm, like, doing nearly 400 damage currently. 392 damage, let alone the amount of times I crit with this set. It's ridiculous.
This is such a good set. Honestly, it would be even better if I just went ahead and like totally valored it, but I'm not, nah. Th this is my guild set. Plus it gives me supernovas. Ancient shards. Rough edge. <laughs> what a rough find. Ooh, 499. All right. Last hunt of the night. Give that a few seconds. Three, two, two and a half, two and three quarters. See, I went back up two and three quarters. One, zero. Okay, last hunt of the night. All yours. Let's make this happen. But yeah, no, the, the huge plan right now is to just. I, I'm gonna spend the whole day cleaning tomorrow, making sure that I can get as many things that I don't need throughout the next week or so out of the way. Welcome. Please be white fatalities. Oh god, no, please don't let it be white fatalities. But you know, it, it very, very, very easily could be. I will say, I might actually just stick with this set for white fatalities, because I believe in myself. I love that phrase. Oh, 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 oh. Oh my god. <laughs> Never mind, I don't believe in myself. I'm switching sets. Oh, the nightmare. The point is, it's Fatalis. They must be chilling in chat. That's that's what's going on. They were looking at chat and they're like, I wonder what I should post. Reads chat. Please be white Fatalis. Oh, I can post white Fatalis. Or a Fatalis. Bring my infinity oil. Make sure I got my cold drinks. Glad I made sure I had my cold drinks. Eat for Defender High. This is a fire one, so we're gonna eat fire res. Even though my fire res is already pretty fantastic. Now it's a nice clean 30, 23. Let's make this happen. Ooh. Hmm. And then this will be the end of the stream. It was a good stream, though. I had a great time. Well, I've got my cold drink. And by cold drink forgetting, I mean I forgot to eat my cold drink. Or drink it, I guess. I don't know. Whatever, whatever the thing is. I'm going to take a far caster. And then that max potion is for whoever carts. That, that's that's honestly the best way to do these kinds of hunts. Let's make this happen. English Island is one of my favorite maps. Except for the random fire guys that take off half your health and do it. <laughs> you know, the way that you phrase that, it just makes it sound like this is your least favorite map. Amazing. It's not like I wanted to hit you or anything. Alright, time to find that nice special spot underneath his foot. Yeah, right there. That, that's where I want to be. This train ain't stopping. Go check out the head, man. Yeah, 
don't want to be there because, yep, called it. I, I was like, oh, I'm by its belly. That That's scary. <laughs> Immediately moves out of the way of the belly. Monster falls on top. All right, get to that hidden spot right there. That's the secret spot, by the way. You don't want to get hit by it, but you don't. You want to keep hitting it. That's a secret. Honestly, I really enjoyed the LB light heavy bowgun and rise or light bowgun and rise. I'm glad that you did. Light bowgun is super fun. I myself am not a fan. I like. I don't know. There's something about the heavy bowgun that's just so slow and fulfilling. Like it, I don't know. It's methodical to me. Like you, I don't know. You saw the way I was playing Gravios over there that last time. Like that. That's the way heavy bowgun just is for me. Super nice and relaxing for me. I lost my uh, my wheels. Oh my god! Oh my god! Mm, that was exactly what I wanted to avoid doing. And that was that was what was going on in my head. As all of that happened to me, I was going, man, it sure would blow if this guy knocked me into a giant meteor proceeds to get knocked into a giant meteor. Game read my mind. Mm, my god. Why isn't anybody targeting the head? That's where all the damage is at. 200 damage this monster to target the head. This is the secret spot for me. But when the monster's down, you guys go target the head because you guys can hit the head all of a sudden. That's where all the damage is at. Donating proximity on monsters with pure ammo is fun. Okay, that is totally fine. Like, I, I, I hella agree with that. I like the fast moving weapon attack speed is optional, but the preferable. And Light Bowgun fits that spot perfectly along with Blue Blades. Oh, yeah, for sure. The slowest weapon that I really enjoy is uh, Switch X because that's not really all that slow. That's fair. Let me get that ready for us. Get some more SP arts going on here in a minute. There we go. Big SP boost. I'll never use gunner weapons me two years ago. See, for me, I was like, there's guns, and then I immediately gravitated towards them. <laughs> like, as soon as I was like, you know what I haven't touched yet? I need a gunner weapons. That sounds like... I'm definitely just going to go target ahead with this Shoryuki. Oh, Mitsu has to be in chat. They've totally been listening to me. There we go. Yes. I will tear you apart, man. Let me get this. Awesome! I'm so happy I got that off. Now I can throw down one of these. Oh, that did not quite work out as well as I hoped. Some container made out of... Oh, my God. Some container made out of plastic just fell, and the hollow knock scared the shit out of me. Same, but from, like, 3U. I heard 3U guns were very bizarre, and, like, 4U guns were also still, like, not great, but, like, they were just usable. And then Gu guns are just actually insane. And then world guns are just entirely different. And that's how it goes. I legit got chills all over my body. Uh, you know, I've actually been in that exact same situation before. Get some more booster real quick. My joints felt weak. Oh, no, this is not going so well. Man, 
man. Why is Crimson so scary? I totally forgot to eat a cold drink. How could I forget these things? And soon the screech owls start their distorted monkey screeches. Which are sick. <laughs> I wish I had more Screech Owls in my area. It's like music to my ears. I live right next to some woods and a ton of farmland, so there's animals going more. Ah, gotcha. No, that that that's totally fair. All right, we got we got we got time for one redo on whatever, and after that, I'm going straight to bed. Very tired. After I get some videos uploaded, I'm like currently in the process of uploading tons and tons of videos, but. I'm going to try and make sure I can restart that process tonight. All right. Let's see. Three. Two. Oh, that's it. Miku's gone. That being said, everybody who came out to the to the stream, thank you for coming out. Um, I had a good time. I mean, I always do. But, but if I'm if I'm not having a good time, I'm not streaming. Let's go ahead and see if who's online right now. Uh, let's see here. Bio jump. Oh, Amber Learner's playing. Some rivals. We're, let's go. Let's go read Amber Learner. There, there, like, uh, there's somebody in my chat. They are a super cool person. They actually are a fantastic pixel artist. And they are also very good at Rivals of Ether, especially playing with around with custom characters. So we're going to go ahead and give them a raid. I have not seen them in a while. It'll be fun. Um, that being said, everyone who made it out tonight, thanks for coming out. Everybody who, you know, all of the things. All, all the things. Tomorrow night, I'm going to be streaming Twilight Princess. I hope I see you guys then. Um, up until then, good night. Sleep well, and uh, I'll catch you later. So long. And there isn't even a lot to go off of, and it's an actual coherent move, though. That's insane. And also, apparently, I'm, I'll read that in a moment. I don't know. Hello, Amber. Hello there. Okay, I'm gone away from Babacar. Wow. Uh, welcome. Babacar to the people. Hello, Amber. Hello, 